So Wayne, you're going to be one of the few pilots in the world to have done refueling with an airman. When you're trailing, the lateral uh, control is, is very stable. looking real good. Very nice. I was going around. It just felt natural. I say I, I, I like the formation task. It's pretty cool. Feels like what I'm trying to accomplish, I'm actually uh, able to do it. So that's a nice feeling. I must say, I, I, I like the formation task. It's pretty cool. It feels like what I'm trying to accomplish, I'm actually uh, able to do it. So that's a nice feeling. Can you wave your hand a little bit left and right? Nice. You could, but I could trust uh, a, a lot. I could trust everything that was going on there. And the reason we mentioned this later on is it never got into my mind at all. And I didn't think about it until we talked about it after the fight. The latency issue. There was no latency. This, uh, this queuing system you have here, it gets your gains up. And like we talked about uh, in the past, you want to identify PIO tendencies. I mean, that's what you want out of this is the ability to break out control systems, whether they have good qualities or not, uh, be a good training aid if that's what you want to do with it, and to not hurt anyone, but get that pile of motion up there. That's, that's, that's what this does. I mean, it got me. I mean, I'm not just, I go out and try and give you the best I can as a test pilot, but uh, at the end, uh, my legs were shaking, so um, my hat's metric. off to you for doing this. So That's a good metric. It's a very good metric.